I'm not sure what people's stereotypes about full-time photographers actually is, um, but whatever it is, I don't think it's somebody that looks like me. Whenever I show people my portfolio or my website and tell them about some of the people I've worked with and some of the people I've photographed, the next question then generally is, did you take these pictures? My nan basically said, what, you're going to take pictures? Because how can that sustain a living? You know when you, when you, you go into a career and you think to yourself, okay, it'd be absolutely amazing if I could do X, Y, Z. So these are probably my five biggest kind of like wow moments in my career. The first one photographing Barack Obama and David Cameron, that just feels like a really kind of iconic picture now because none of them are leaders anymore. But yeah, I was privileged not to be one of the people to kind of get that, that photo. So name some of those people for me. Beckham, Andre, Nelvane, not everybody knows her, so well done. The reason I take people through some of this type of work is just to show that there are creatives like me, that look like me, that are doing this type of thing. This one, nothing um, as iconic in the same way as Barack Obama, but it was iconic for me because I got um, commissioned to shoot Usher and he used to be a poster on my bedroom wall when I was like 18. <laughs> The previous one was um, Richard Branson. I was going to ask him about my Virgin Media because it is running a little slow at the moment. <laughs> uh, often, I'm um, one of very few women delivering, I mean, um, shooting press photography, and often I'm the only black woman shooting press photography. So I would say if this is something you want to do as a full time career, it's just to keep practicing, practicing, practicing so that your skills are always up to what the market needs. As a creative, you can go through periods of time where you really feel like this isn't working, I'm not going to be able to make this work, I'm not going to be able to make a career, how do I pay my water bill, how do I pay my mortgage? When I first decided to go into photography 10 years ago and people thought I was crazy for doing this, I could never have imagined my career path would lead to some of the places that, that it leads to now. Being full-time in a creative career is completely, completely viable and possible. So I'm going to end there.